Hi. You know there are people who walk into a room and just immediately they grab attention. They project gravitas, confidence, poise under pressure. But were they always this way? Imagine running your company, thinking you were successful, and then being fired by the board because you were perceived as unmanageable and not adding any value. This happened to Apple founder Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs fired from his own company. How would you feel? Disappointed, frustrated, angry, full of self-doubt, self-criticism? But Jobs went away reflected, looked inward, and started again. He built another computer company, Next, which was acquired by Apple in 1997, reacquiring Steve Jobs back into the company. And later that year, he became the CEO of Apple again. But this time, he has confidence, poise, gravitas. He has been transformed into the leader that gave us those iconic product launches. And as we know, the rest is history. So age experience will give us executive presence, this ability to project, uh, project gravitas, confidence and poise under pressure. But you can accelerate it. I'm currently coaching a young executive. And just yesterday, she gave her first presentation to the board of a company she's recently joined. Now, prior to our coaching, she was nervous, she used to speak fast, she didn't take a breath, and she was not projecting that gravitas. But applying some self-leadership strategies, she was able to step into her vessel of confidence and project that confidence and gravitas. And I'm pleased to say that she just messaged me to say, you know, that she absolutely rocked the presentation and that the board was super impressed with her. So if you're interested in learning some of these strategies for success that will increase your executive presence, then click on the link in the comments below because I prepared a free webinar for you to expand on these concepts. My name is Andrew Bryant, the Self-Leadership Coach, and I look forward to seeing you in the webinar.